In this video, we'll discuss what Integration Hub is and the benefits of using it. Now put simply, Integration Hub allows you to build reusable Integration Hub actions with clicks, not code. These actions are typically used in Flow Designer. The primary benefits of Integration Hub are to reduce technical debt from scripted integrations by creating configurable, reusable actions and making integrations easier to use for low-code developers. Building and maintaining Integration Hub actions is far easier than their scripted counterpart. Even a simple outbound REST message that would take 15 to 20 lines of code to script can be done with a few clicks in less time. Additionally, when our actions are installed and published, our low-code users can easily access them through Flow Designer like any other action. They simply fill in the inputs to our action and they get the outputs needed to automate their process. Groups of similar actions are called spokes, as in integration hub and spokes. For example, we might download a spoke from the ServiceNow store to interface with Google Calendar, or build our own custom spoke to exchange information with an internal web service provider. Best practice is to create a spoke in its own scope and use the name spoke at the end of the scope name. Okay, that sounds like a children's rhyme, so let's do a quick example. Let's say we're going to create a new spoke to connect to Bitly, the popular URL shortener, to create and maintain short links. We would create a new app or scope with the name Bitly Spoke. All our Bitly actions would be part of this spoke. When the actions are presented in Flow Designer, the menu option simply appears as Bitly to avoid displaying the word spoke on each one. When we see our Bitly app listed among the other apps, it's clear that this one is a dedicated spoke. Integration Hub is a licensed product, so please consult your account team to learn more. Integration Hub is available on personal developer instances for learning and experimenting. And Integration Hub is most commonly accessed through Flow Designer, but as we'll see in upcoming videos, more capabilities are being added all the time. One of the ways you can access the actions outside Flow Designer is with the Flow API. This enables us to call Integration Hub actions from business rules, script includes, UI actions, and more. Now from the doc site, search for scriptable flow runner. The actions themselves are built with the same action designer as any other flow designer action. Connections and credentials can also be managed via the connections tab in Flow Designer. Finally, before building any custom spokes, check the ServiceNow store to see if what you need is already there. Microsoft, Google, AWS, Jenkins, and more have multiple spokes to choose from. If the store doesn't have what you're looking for, check with your account team as it may be on the product roadmap. New spokes are being added all the time. I hope this video helps you understand what Integration Hub is and why it's so powerful. Let's move on and take a look at how to access it.